alarming news about the life-saving drug naloxone. According to Indianapolis Emergency Medical Services, the use of the opioid antidote hit an all-time high in Marion County. And just as alarming, the price. RTV6 Jack Reinhardt has details. The demand for naloxone, the antidote for an opioid overdose, is skyrocketing. Just as alarming, the price is going up as well. The use of naloxone set an all-time Indianapolis record with 152 life-saving doses in the month of June. Over the past three years, the number of doses has steadily climbed with a record 1,225 units last year. And the cost has climbed as well. Indianapolis Emergency Medical Services paid just over $10 a dose in July of 2013, only to see the price triple in just 18 months. And for people who want to buy naloxone over the counter, can now expect to pay a pharmacy price of $150 and higher. Lifeline Overdose is a not-for-profit organization that purchases naloxone for police departments across central Indiana. Police departments, whereas maybe in the past we'd give them 20 units, maybe now we're only able to afford and give them 10, so we're spreading a little bit more thin. Maybe now we're able to outfit all law enforcement officers that are actually on patrol with it. First responders equipped with the opioid antidote have saved more and more lives, and the legislature has enacted laws to make naloxone available without prescription. But for families that live with addiction, the cost may limit access. But a lot of our individuals who are overdosing don't have basic health insurance, and, and you're asking them to purchase a medicine that's hundreds of dollars, maybe even thousands of dollars, and, and they just won't be able to do that. Central Indiana is sorely lacking in addiction treatment facilities. The increased cost of the antidote may create the perfect storm for a public health epidemic. And we've got to really begin to look at this like diabetes or cancer uh, and really connect recovery and make it a full partner of the, uh, uh, the whole treatment continuum. Central Indiana is in the midst of a public health crisis with life-saving naloxone moving out of reach. In Indianapolis, Jack Reinhardt, RTV6.